In this video, you're going to learn about the different types of hip replacement surgery. A total hip replacement surgery is a commonly performed surgical procedure used to treat arthritis of the hip. The types of arthritis that can be treated by a total hip replacement include arthritis from wear and tear, and traumatically induced arthritis, and inflammatory arthritis. The difference between the traditional surgical techniques and the anterior approach boil down to the amount of unavoidable muscle, nerve, and tendon damage the patient experiences during the surgery. Traditional approaches to the hip invariably cut through muscles, nerves, and possibly tendons before entering the hip joint to perform the replacement. The anterior approach passes between the muscles and tendons from the front of the hip. By accessing the hip joint through the inter nerves, the surgeon can avoid injury to the same muscles and tendons that he once would have cut. A couple of traditional advantages are purely due to the procedure being performed with the patient lying flat instead of on their side with other approaches. The primary benefit is the x-ray can be taken much easier and much earlier than the traditional technique. A secondary benefit is that patients usually experience less discomfort due to lying on their side for an extended period of time. Another advantage is that by approaching the hip from the front leaves the ligaments, tendons, and muscles in the back completely intact. This dramatically decreases the risk of delocation to the hip following the replacement surgery. This reduction of risk usually eliminates the need of post-operative total hip precautions mandated by traditional surgical approaches. The other frequently noted advantage is a massive decrease in the amount of time needed for rehabilitation. Many, if not most, anterior hip replacement patients are able to walk with the cane by three weeks. In some respects, the outcomes of the anterior approach are the same as or slightly worse than traditional surgery. The risk of infection, blood clot formation, bleeding, and other systemic problems have a similar level of risk. The risk of fracture of the hip are slightly higher when performed anteriorly. Despite this, in many cases, anterior hip replacements tend to be less risky in general and offer quicker recovery than the traditional surgery. IBJI's physicians are some of the most highly trained and experienced orthopedic specialists available. Make an appointment today with your joint replacement specialist and start recovering the mobility you lost.